Now, in 1984, two big things happened. One, Ghostbusters debuted and rocked our culture as we knew it. And two, Dan Fowler was born. Being born the same time the movie came out has a significant impact on my life. Every Christmas and birthday were Ghostbusters. Saturday morning cartoons, Ghostbusters. Everything, Ghostbusters. And ever since then, I always knew what I wanted to be when I grew up. But now to be a good Ghostbuster, had to be knowledgeable about the basic foundations of the paranormal and the supernatural. Now, I committed myself to tons of research from Token Spirit Guide to Man, Myth, and Magic. And I always keep myself in top Ghostbusting prime through constant routine practices. Whether it be through computer simulations, aerobics, or conditioning my body for strenuous activity with a 35-pound backpack. And I've even been developing my own ESP abilities to help the team out through Dr. Venkman's negative reinforcement technique. Bunch of wavy lines. <laughs> All right. So the owners next door reported sightings of a ghost in their old place over here. And now I don't have the money or the skills to build myself an unlicensed nuclear accelerator, so I'm having to rely on the basic tools of an amateur Ghostbuster. Your Chinese folklore salt, cross, trusty tableside Bible, and of course, the official Ghostbusters patch. Let's go. Ah! What the? Hey! Get off me! What are you doing? Ah! Yeah, this is a big bust. I busted a guy in a Halloween costume, I swear. The next time I run to a guy in a costume, I'm just gonna... <laughs> like, did they catch him? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, I told you to stay out of here. So look, bottom line, I'm a huge Ghostbusters fan. I have been studying the activities of the paranormal and supernatural all my life just for the chance to be able to strap on a proton pack and save the world. So please, Ghostbusters, believe me when I say I'm ready to step off to the big leagues and kick some ghosts and be the next representative of the Ghostbusters. You won't be disappointed. I promise you this. This is Dan Fowler, out.